so in this video we are going to discuss that whether we should use chat gpt to solve the read code problems or not over the internet a lot of discussions is going that whether it is ethic or not we should take the help from the chat gpt or not so what i am going to say and this is my uh, point of view that we should take the help from the chat gpt but not for the copy and paste purpose right so in this video i am going to explain how you going to take the advantage effectively of the chat gpt to solve your uh, the read code problems so let us start what is my approach to uh, take the advantage of the chat gpt so for that i will say uh, go to the read code and uh, take the difficulty is uh, hard and uh, choose any problems here so let, let me go for this copy this the merge k sort and come to the um, chat gpt in my previous video i have already explained how to use and all those things so you can refer this video uh, this video that uh, how to use that so here just solve and paste your problems so if you see the uh, chat gpt it is not not just giving the uh, copy paste kind of solutions but it will also explain that what is the problem how to solve that so each by each step it will going to uh, show you so if you see it is complete uh, giving the information what is the problem and saying this is one way to solve the problem to use the mean heap that means there might be couple uh, other alternatives other approach would be also there so he is going to explain one of the approach and that we take the time complexity of the n log k and the k uh, represent the how many list are there right and you can see this is giving the uh, complete code over here so let me complete the code but if you see uh, this code is not in java it is in different language so i can say that uh, uh, please uh, give the solution in uh, in java only so i will type here solve merge k list in java so uh, the second instructions to chat gpt that uh, give me the solutions in um, in java so if you see it is giving the complete explanations that what is the k uh, merging k sort list and how you will do that and then again it is giving the same expansion what is given for the uh, python language so you can see it is giving that the i am going to the some um, java code to demonstrate how to solve the problem so if you see it is giving the code here and they have given the copy paste option you can just click on that copy and paste okay sometime it's got fail so you have to face it so he's commented uh, what um, is which list node is going to use is on the assumptions so once you get the solution then you can ask again to chat gpt that explain me this code so what if we do that you this is the main code right merge list uh, this one or this is the part of the code somewhere so suppose uh, if you are not able to understand this part of the code or any any piece of the code so you just copy those part so suppose i am not uh, not able to understand why is taking the pq and why it is uh, checking the condition is empty or not so in that case what you do you can just say that explain flowing code and paste it now it will explain this code so in this way you can uh, able to understand piece of the code instead of just copy and paste so see that output this code is the while loop that contain the list of priority queue everything they are uh, explaining to you so this way you can take the advantage of the chat gpt and uh, you will try to understand that okay so this piece of code what is the use of that and how what it is doing that even suppose i have taken one example but if you not able to understand other piece of code you can just copy and ask what you tell me explain me how this code is working why you have taken this code so he will give the explanation in very detail that if you see here it is saying the next element of the tail has to set the smallest element because you are using the uh, pole method it will give the first element mean heap is there so all those things it is uh, explaining here right so but if you see this code is not the uh, complete code he is given the just piece of code in one method so if i say no uh, i want the complete java code uh, including the main method means i need the complete code including the main method so i will just write that uh, and coding main method here yeah. 
So now if you see it will give the complete uh, copy paste kind of code so including the main method and that is not required for the read code but uh, uh, for if you want to learn you can take from here. This time if you can see it will give the main main method also. So you don't need to add the main method you can directly take the main method from here itself. So uh, it is giving the complete explanations right. So now uh, one step more I no need to just if you can see he is writing the main method here. One step more so I want the unit test cases. So for your understanding how this code is working or not, whether they have a coverage of the code or not. So I want to use test cases for that. So then you can see that, right, you need test cases for FF code. You can see still is giving the complete explanation for that. They will create the two list L1, L2. Right. Okay. And we see write unit test cases for the FF code. You can see that it will write the complete unit test cases that you can just copy and paste in your any ID in TJ or Eclipse and you can test that. So these are the things we can take the advantage from the uh, chat GPT that not only for the uh, these things, not only for the copying the solutions and paste and just commit that. You should try to take the more advantage from the chat GPT uh, in many different way. First way I told you that you can take the complete code including the man method. Second uh, things I told you that go and create the new test cases so you can understand that how your code is working and there are the many other ways I am going to explain you what are the different things you can do it. So see he is a complete, he is giving the complete code including the import annotations everything they are giving that you have to just copy and paste and understand that and you go each by each code and uh, then you can see that so suppose a uh, test case is 2 or the test case is 3 uh, one test case you are not able to understand so again you can do the same thing you can ex say explain the test test case is 2 in the uh, above unit test cases so they will explain you okay so suppose this test case is no, not able to understand so you can say that explain test case 2 in above unit test cases. So it will explain you what is the second unit test cases and then um, see it is explaining you why what is the purpose for the second unit test cases and what you are going to achieve that. So uh, that is at least you cannot do uh, through the any uh, search engine right so it will not the any search engine is not the conversational uh, uh, AI uh, kind of chatbot right here we are talking some persons it looks some person are sitting behind your screen and whatever you are asking and giving the answer so he just uh, showing that second test cases and he explained everything what is the second test cases so you can take the advantage from here right so suppose uh, uh, when you write the code right we consider the many corner cases so if you want to know what are the corner cases for this the solution how you can get it. So I can say that what are the corner cases for FF code. So then it will explain you suppose if this is the empty uh, ring list, if this is only one element, how you can do that. See it is saying that if input array is the just a null or empty, if input array list contain only the null element, no null element. So these kind of things really we can take the benefit from the chat GPT and uh, we can uh, uh, understand these solutions more closely and with the many different way, right. So first I said how to uh, uh, generate the Java code and I say how to generate the new test cases then I am saying what is the different way uh, the corner cases could be there to in this uh, problem in this solution. See he explained everything what are the different corner cases right. These things you can take the advantage of that right. So suppose uh, uh, now uh, I want to know is any better solution what he has given that I say is any way to further optimize the FF code. 
So is any way by which you can more uh, optimize the solutions. So it we say that uh, the f of complexity is the O analog k number of fish and uh, they are using that they use the priority queue but some other options you know we have that right we have the double pointer approach we have the divided and concur approach everything they will explain here so that is just awesome right so you can able to solve the problem in different way so first what the, he generated the code or he or she chatbot so it was the using the uh, uh, heap so now i can say that okay give me the solution that we use the divided and concord so these kind of things you can do that so i can say that um, okay if it is the case i can say uh, solve the a of code using divide and concord so the first solution was there with the mean heap and now i want to uh, know the same solution with the help of the uh, uh, the concure uh, divided and concure approach so let me see that how it is going and again uh, when you get the solution for the divided and concure and you are didn't able to understand some part again you just copy and paste and ask the chat uh, gpt that what is the use of this piece of code what is what this uh, snippet is doing here so those things also you can ask that so i think in this way the chat gpt is very better uh, uh, tools or the application by which you can understand your solutions in many different way and uh, one thing i want to say here might be some questions is not able to solve by the chat gpt right so uh, i heard that some kind of question is not able to solve that so okay so i don't want to solve all the problem what the problem i'm going to solve the solutions take the more advantage with a different approach to understand the problems right so you can see that they have solved the problem with the uh, with uh, the divided and concure again if you don't want you didn't explain this part so you can just copy and say that uh, please uh, uh, please explain me this code you can say this please explain this uh, code piece or snippet and paste it it will explain you so what are the uh, what is the purpose he, he start explaining you uh, where will we get this kind of tutor to explain each and every steps uh, presence for they will research your doubt and give the answer right again uh, if you want to solve the problem using the two pointer approach you can say that uh, hey uh, uh, chat gpt solve a yeah, verb code using two pointer approach then we solve the code in the two pointer approach right so one solutions one problems chat gpt is able to solve in different way uh, to for the better understanding from this way that we use test cases corner cases and uh, there are many things right so now i want to know which approach will give the less complexity right so i can say tell me which approach is giving the less complexity so just you can type here which approach has the less, less complexity to solve the mole scale list so you can just hit that or the solution is still going you can just wait so you can compare the complexity space complexity time complexity understanding which approach is giving the good what is the difference between the different uh, approach to solve this problem right so it is not just the copy the copy paste the code but instead of that you can use as a chatbot as a tutor they can explain the many things see what are the expressions is there so if you just be honest if you just read all those lines so what i is showing here it will be a good input to understand any kind of the problems which can be uh, solved by the chat gpt see everything they are explaining that here okay which approach has the risk complexity to solve the so it will give that approach which approach you should do that right in saying that this approach is the is uh, divided and concur is the better op options to do that so then i can say that okay uh, give me the complexity uh, for all the approach right i want to see 
uh, which approach has the better for me so i can say that okay give me the complexity of the of the, of the approach to solve the uh, merge key sorted array sorted waste so it will give the complete explanations they start the priority queue and why the priority queue has this complexity and okay they explain that then again they will explain for the uh, divide and con queue the, again they will explain the two pointer approach right so it will explain each and everything in the detail that is really very 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 beneficial to understand any problems here right so it is the give me the complete detail but i want in very short i want in brief that give me just uh, explanations uh, uh, the time and the space complexity of the approach i don't want to give get any many details so you can just uh, copy uh, you can just say that give me time and space complexity of the each approach to solve that so in short they will give all the answer to you so this is up to us how you are going to use any uh, tools and technique right so i think this is a very good opportunity to use the chat uh, gpt to uh, understand the read code problems to solve the read code problems to understand the unit test cases complexity uh, all those things what you used to do that you can take the advantage from here and chat gpt is the good teacher who can uh, help you uh, to many ways to solve the read code problems right so again that i am saying uh, just copy and paste is not the good thing don't do that otherwise you cannot understand anything go in a detailed way take one of questions and try to get the solutions in the different approach unit test cases execute unit test cases do some mistake in the code and say hey fix the problems where the mistake is there all those things uh, you can do that so uh, i am going to say that uh, this is a good uh, uh, platform whether you can use in very right way and really that uh, miss chat gpt is going to help you a lot to solve the read code problems not only solving the problems but also it will give the good understanding what are the different approach what are the different unit cases and if you don't want to understand some snippet you can explain all those things so hope this video is uh, useful for you informative for you if it is uh, that then please subscribe the channel and share in your friend circle also thank you very much